hey guys uh, this is normal for technique and today we will see the new microsoft camera app uh, for the windows phone 8.1 so along with uh, the changes to windows phone 8.1 microsoft has al also updated the camera app so previously the camera was uh, camera app was uh, pretty much basic and you had this uh, nokia camera app for um, much better options so now microsoft has uh, gone ahead and added uh, more features and a better interface to the camera app on the windows phone 8.1 so if you have windows phone 8.1 you can check out this new app it has a much better interface as well as a few other options as well so let's uh, have a quick look at this app so when you press the camera button on your windows phone it will take you to the default camera app so uh, the default camera app is uh, currently the microsoft camera app for our on our phone so let's uh, go ahead and see the features on uh, this app so you can see similar to the nokia camera you have the options on the left side and the shooting modes on the right side so first let's have a look at the shooting mode so first is the single photo mode and then you have the burst mode uh, where you can take uh, multiple photos in one go so it's it's pretty uh, much what you have the burst mode what you have in other other camera and then you have the video camera so these are the three options what you uh, what you see on the light side so it's a single photo then you have the burst photo and as well as the video uh, mode uh, then uh, if you if you see on the left side you have a uh, five option five set of options so first is the uh, camera i mean the gallery view then you have the front facing camera then you have the flash mode which you can select to change the mode then uh, next is uh, you have the lenses so we already know the camera lenses on the windows phone so these lenses apps are pretty much uh, useful if you want to get more functionality out of your camera say for example the bing vision it will scan your qr codes then you have cam scanner which will which can be used for document scanning and there are quite a lot of other camera lenses so we won't go into depth of these camera apps uh, camera lenses so this this is a well known feature in windows phone 8 as well now apart from that you also have uh, this uh, scenes so right now we have a uh, few scene options so these are auto then you have close up night night protect sports as well as backlight so these are the options on the left side but the best part of this camera app is that you can configure this left panel that means you can set whichever you want uh, as the favorite options here so for that just go to here go to the settings the three dots um, on the right hand side and you can see the five options available here so we can see right now it's the gallery the front facing camera flash uh, the lenses and uh, the scene modes now if you don't want lenses here if you are not using lenses um, uh, frequently so you can change lenses you can click lens and then you can uh, change the option so you, you have a few options you can see camera roll uh, the resolution you can change it to resolution you can uh, um, change to lens speaker then you have front your rear camera which is already available flash is already available scenes are already available then you have uh, iso exposure values and white balance so let's uh, select iso here now you can see here uh, the uh, the um, option here has been changed from lenses to iso and you can see that option here so when you select this uh, you have this iso option so based on what whichever features you are using most frequently you can change the left panel so out of the say around eight or ten options other you can have uh, the max five options here so whichever your options you use the most you can change it uh, on the left hand side and uh, then you have the normal photo settings where you have this flash uh, tap to take photo you can keep the burst uh, mode photos for seven days then uh, scenes you can set iso exposure values white balance aspect ratio and focus assist light so these are the options in the um, settings so these are mostly available in the previous uh, camera as well, camera app as well because uh, uh, you had the option to select the iso scenes etc so now the only change is uh, the burst mode so we you can uh, select uh, uh, how many days you want the burst mode photos to be kept so that is uh, seven days by default then you have the video settings you have white balance continuous focus and the video mode which is um, uh, full hd as well as um, uh, 720p hd so these are the two options so the burst mode is something new on uh, the windows phone camera but before we go there we'll have a we'll take a sample shot of uh, this app so uh, in order to focus you can just touch on this uh, screen and then it will take a uh, photo by automatically focusing that object so you can see here this is pretty simple and it's it's very good app as well now let's move on to the burst mode so you can see here um, uh, the burst mode takes uh, around 15 photos in one go so just i'll just press this app uh, press here 
and you can see a timer here countdown here that that uh, indicates the number of photos taken now you can see here this is the photo taken in burst mode so whenever whenever you taken a photo in burst mode you can see the uh, there's an icon called uh, burst and uh, you can click uh, this uh, to select the burst photos so this is the burst mode so you can see here all the photos taken in burst mode so these are the photos taken in burst mode so you can select whichever uh, you want so you can see there are quite a lot of um, photos taken and uh, you can select them 15 photos to be precise so those are the number of photos taken using the burst mode so based on whichever you like you can just click uh, save uh, and uh, save and clean up so okay let's select one photo so we have selected one photo you can see a tick mark now you can click save so that photo will be processed now you can what you, what else you can do here is uh, you can save and clean up so this means uh, you didn't select any photo are you sure you want to delete all the photos in the burst mode so let's select one photo then you can click uh, save and um, uh, i mean uh, delete the rest so we are saving one photo in the burst mode and deleting the rest so when you click here only this photo will be saved so rest all the photos um, will be deleted because it takes unnecessary space in your phone so this will be the rest all photos will be deleted and only this photo will be retained so that's the burst mode for you now this is a new feature uh, in the windows phone cam and uh, you can uh, quickly uh, access the phone gallery by just swiping from here i mean left to right and it will open the gallery uh, you can view all the photos and if you go to the extreme end you can see uh, you can get once again back into the camera mode and in the video camera mode it's very simple uh, you have uh, this option to touch and then start the recording and you have this big uh, button here so that will enable you to pause i mean the stop the recording so that's uh, that's uh, that's the recording part now uh, you have this uh, single camera mode single photo mode so that's a very very much similar so there isn't much change here so you can just take photos from here so these are the options say in the nokia i mean the microsoft camera app for windows phone 8.1 so we would say this is a much improved camera app because it's uh, you have this burst mode as well as much better control of the option so whichever options you use uh, more frequently can be changed here so and you also have almost all the options like uh, iso exposure values so then you have uh, a night mode or the scene mode uh, where you can customize them so overall this camera app is much improved uh, uh, than the better uh, i mean than the previous one which we had on the windows phone 8 so we uh, we expect uh, this camera app to uh, be much more refined when uh, uh, we have this uh, final version of windows phone 8.1 at least uh, later in a couple of months so that's all uh, in the windows phone uh, camera app on windows phone 8.1 so if you have any specific queries regarding this camera app you can shoot a comment and we'll be glad to help you out with your queries if you like this video do hit the like button subscribe for more videos like this and uh, thanks for watching this video